The news media was out in force for Nixon's arrival, and so were security people. More than two dozen Secret Service and Mexican federal agents kept an eye out for trouble, but their only problem was an overly aggressive Tijuana newspaper man who was quickly herded back in line. Nixon arrived from San Clemente by motorcade and spent several minutes shaking hands with Tijuana dignitaries. One of those he met was the 10-year-old son of a Mexican industrialist who got the former president's autograph. He said he'll come very soon here to, to with, her, with his wife to with it to their 40th anniversary here. As he boarded the Aeromexico DC-10, Nixon stopped to wave at the crowd, then disappeared into the jet. Security agents searched the rest of the passengers, delaying the flight for half an hour. The only thing that turned up was an unclaimed bag containing clothes and papers. Mr. Nixon's trip may only be an elaborate goodwill gesture, but it's one the former president thinks other U.S. allies who are still in power will take to heart. Gene Cubison, News 8, Tijuana.